Welcome back. Happy Oscars week. Yes, the Oscars. Yeah. Do you think yeah. they'll, uh, is there a chance that that will um, get to a point where they just don't do them anymore? That's, I think that's what they want to do. I think they want the show to be 10 minutes long and just to be on TikTok. <laughs> I, think that's what I think that's what their goal is eventually is going to be. So, I, you know, it just, it, uh, I, I have been slowly over the years just less interested in the Oscars. I don't know if it's just becoming a grumpy old man type of situation. Um, uh, but um, I don't like that they're eliminating these categories. I don't know. I, have, I guess I have mixed feelings about them. I, I, I'm pro-eliminating the categories if it actually saves time, but if it just adds to another... 10 minute interpretive dance sequence, yeah. then put the categories back in and let the people give their speeches. So, I mean, it's, uh, um, they have three hosts this year and three strong women, female hosts this year, which is great. Um, so that might be a little bit more entertaining than it's been in the past. Not having, having some true standups in there is good with Wanda Sykes and Amy uh, Schumer, the two, two of the people who are, you know, experienced standups in there. That's always better than just having somebody who doesn't know how to read a room or anything mm -hmm. along those lines. So I'm hoping that'll give it back some life a little bit that it needs, so yeah. Yeah, it's, uh, and I know the, um, the Hollywood community were uh, incensed that the Academy decided to not present the award, certain awards yeah. during the awards right. show. Right, right. That's why I have the award. I mean, it, it's... Yeah, well, also, like, they <laughs> cut down, like, one of the things they did, they cut down the Humanitarian Award and the Cecil B. DeMille Award, they cut that down, um, and those were, like, the most important people, like, in Hollywood history, like, and they don't give them any time. <laughs> So it's like, it's just, they, they, their priorities are a little bit out of whack, I think. But I mean, you know, unless they want to call me and have me produce the show, I'll go ahead and do it. <laughs> um, but, uh, I, you know, and sometimes those speeches, the speeches are the best speeches are by the people you don't know. You know, the famous, it's not famous people. It's by the people in best sound editing or whatever. And they, sometimes they give a great speech, but also sometimes they give a boring speech. So, I, you know, it's, you, you can, there's places you can make. Also, Nobody sits down at the Oscars and goes, boy, I hope this is only going to be two hours. Everybody, you know what you're getting into. That's what yeah. award shows are. They start at 8. You know you're going to be up until 1130. It, it's just that's, you're, that's part of, the, you, know, got, you know, get rid of a commercial break and maybe and then add in a little bit more there if you want to really shorten it down a little bit. So, and also I just think it's, I think we're still reeling from the pandemic, obviously, and it's the, 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 the increased amount of nominees to me makes it worse in a lot of ways. Because now I look at that long list and I, ten. I'm like, I, yeah, 10 movies. And I'm like, well, I've barely seen any of these. And I've seen three, I think, on the total that have been nominated this year, which is normally be a three out of five. That'd be pretty good. But this year it's only three out of 10. So um, it just feels like a, I'm missing out even more, basically, by have not seeing those. So You know, that's a good point about the length. So what? I mean, the, the yeah. Super Bowl is 12 hours long. Right. You know. Exactly. And I that, that think they, they mess the mistake they make. They think people are upset about the length, and it's not the length. It's the, it's the boring stuff. You, it's, it's your commercials. It's your, it's your five-minute commercial breaks that are is what, what's driving us all crazy. So, yeah. Mm -hmm. Or the uh, accountants that would come out. <laughs> right, yeah. Let's, make it, let's take a 10-minute bit about the accountants coming out every year. It's like, we get the accountant joke. Okay, let's move on with it. So, yeah, I don't know. Maybe this, I don't know if that's a legal thing they've got to do. or I don't know. But why, yeah, keep that going. Just get that stuff out of there. But... You know, there's so, there's some good movies that are in there. I've only seen a couple of the movies that are nominated. I like West Side Story. I, 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 but I don't feel qualified to say what is the best picture because I've barely seen any of these films. Yeah. So but I know. It's likely the voters are in the same boat. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. I mean, hopefully they take it seriously and they watch all of them. So, and the film that's um, everyone's talking about winning, which is Coda, um, uh, which is the story of a child of deaf parent, deaf parents wanting to become a singer, is like. Is, uh, it looked great. I never saw it, but I'm glad to hear it get this a buzz because it's like, oh, yeah, maybe I, I definitely want to add that in the list of things that I want to see. So, Well, all I hope is that John Travolta is a presenter and has to introduce somebody he's never heard of. Right, before. or yeah, somebody with a unique uh, original name. Yeah, that would be nice, too. Yeah, as well. Yeah, it'll be interesting to see who they get, they get to come out to the ceremony to actually present this time. So um, I saw like a, one list of presenters, and it had... I can't remember whose name was on it, but yeah, off the top of my head. Well, apparently, uh, the actress that played uh, Maria in West Side Story, um, she's she wasn't even invited to oh, the uh, yeah. Oscars. Welcome she, to Hollywood, kid. <laughs> <laughs> oh wait a minute, I'm in this movie. It's yeah. an, a nominee, but she herself wasn't nominated. Yeah, right, right, yeah, yeah. But, but they, they've since decided. Well, we'll have her come and if that present was bad, something. Yeah. yeah. Well, I think there's also a, I don't know if it's, if it's at the, the theater, if, I don't know if it's at the theater, if it's still 
like in a train station like they did it was that who did that in a train, <laughs> train station who did it in a train station it was, was it the oscars it was, it was, it was like the oscars. It was the oscars last year they did it in a train station for some reason um i don't know if it's still in that in that train station or what but if it's actually uh, maybe they just don't have the seats i don't know maybe it's like the maybe it's like the football actual fans can't come it's only for vips now so even the actors can't make it in i don't know I mm -hmm. limited i don't know yeah who knows? yeah who knows mm -hmm. all right so what um what are you watching right now? Are you binge watching something? Yeah, we just finished uh, binge watching a great show on um, which Amy Schumer, who is hosting one of the hosts of the Oscars this year, it's a show that she created, um, uh, wrote it, produced it, did, uh, directed many of the episodes of it. Um, it's on Hulu called Life and Beth, and um, it's sort of a, it's it's based on her life, um, uh, not as a stand-up comedian, but as she, but meeting her husband and sort of changing her life and coming to terms with some of the things from her own past. And it is a beautiful, beautiful show. I mean, um, we, we watched all 10 episodes of it in about four days, which is, which is very rare for us. Um, usually it takes us a lot longer to get through a show. They put all, I kind of, I, I, it was good to see a show drop all the episodes at once. They haven't really been doing that much anymore. A lot of shows are coming out mm -hmm. once a week and they, they put all out in 10 days. And it was, it was great to just savor the show and just kind of watch a couple episodes a night over about four days, four or five days. What's yeah. it called? Uh, Life and Beth is the Life name of it. Life and Beth. We mm -hmm. actually have a clip. Oh, great. Right. Let's Thank take you. a look. Uh, just a few questions. I can just save you some time. Ooh. I've had over 30,000 drinks. Ooh. Ooh. I don't really chew my food and I'm like barreling toward 40. I just meant like any pre-existing conditions. I'm a woman. Whoa. Whoa. For trouble tonight, I can feel it. <laughs> All right, behave yourselves. We're too old to be here, right? I think yeah. our Chirac is still open. Ooh. Yes. I should definitely get it, right? Mm-hmm. love. That's what I feel pretty ready for a new start. I'm done selling wine. I have an appointment with a wine manager. Cork and Fork magazine called it drinkable. Ooh. Whoa. My boyfriend, he always says I seem like I'm 100. Hey! Hey, babe. Hey. At this point, I'm just following him around like some sad loser. I like really had it together up until two weeks ago, so please. I look in the mirror for love. I was thinking I could come out to Long Island. It went that bad. And he took the breakup like a total champ. Uh-huh. We're both just being completely adult about it. I'm never dating again. It feels so good to be out here. What's his name? Her, and I never name them. Oh, it's delicious. Rabbit liver. Is it rabbit? That's why I don't name them. I gotta find my thing. And I believe that I was meant to coach. Okay, get down. Defense. Oh, oh God, oh. I'm sorry. I really like him, but I've spent a lot of time on guys that I knew weren't right. <laughs> Sometimes our mental pain manifests in our body. I'm finally listening to my instincts, and I'm going for what I want. I'll stay, but only to make sure he's not a murderer. I'm not a murderer. Oh, my God. Hi. Want to come inside where I won't murder you? Global warming, it's so sad, but like, what can we do? Stop buying plastic bottles. <clears throat> this was a gift. Uh, it's, it's a very funny show, but it is a very moving and very warm and the episodes unfold, as, as the show develops, it gets deeper and deeper into pain and trauma and, and sort of overcoming this and our, you know, Childhood pain and childhood trauma, overcoming it as we're getting older, and it, but with still plenty of great, hilarious laughs in it. Mm -hmm. And uh, like we, like you know, it was one of those shows that would episode would end, and then my wife and I would just we just talk about it. Like it would just be like, wow, that was amazing. Let's just talk about that. You know, it was it was a great, uh, it was it was beautiful to watch. I really enjoyed it. How long are the episodes? Like thirty to forty minutes. That's the other thing too. It's there, it's never it's never too long, and it's Hulu, so there's commercials in between, but um, it, it goes very fast and. Uh, it's like we would watch one or two episodes, sometimes three episodes a night, and it was uh, it was great. Hmm. Just absolutely loved it. Mm. I have to check it out. Yeah, yeah, highly recommend it. We watched the first episode of um, Murderville. Oh yeah, yes. yeah. We have that on our list, but we never can commit Don't. to it. Yeah, okay. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's my reaction. I feel like yeah, yeah. yeah. I, I, it's too bad. I I. I well, I know people that love it, so yeah. I, you know, sorry, but <laughs> part of it was um, well. Conan O'Brien is in the first one. Yeah, that's one I wanted to see because I like him yeah. a lot. But and yeah, my wife can't stand Conan okay. O'Brien. Yeah, that'll do it. But she yeah. told me, I 
the end of the show. Oh, okay. You know of, that before? Yeah. yeah. It's, it's, it looks messy in a bad way. Not like I know the premise is like they don't know the script or whatever, but it still looks like it's kind of it's messy, messy in a bad way. Like it didn't it didn't cut together like they thought it would or whatever. Yeah, yeah. It, yeah. it had a good. Uh, in theory, it sounds like a good idea. Yes. Not executed well. That's that's exactly. I I, I cannot get uh, Christy to, not I can't get her to commit to it. But it's just sort of like she's always like I'm like well here's a list of things. What do you think? And that's always like fourth on her ranking. So. Yeah, yeah. Well, mm -hmm. I don't think I helped her. Case. No, yeah. She's probably watching right now going, like, yeah. Or she's mad at me because I'm blaming her, one of the two. But yeah, it, I don't, I, I, it looks the same thing. I mean, it looks good, but I, mean, I know a lot of people that have liked it a lot, too. I've had some friends text me about it and things like that, but it's just like, no, nah, I don't think so. I don't think so. Mm -hmm. All right, well, enjoy, enjoy, the night, enjoy your night at the Oscars. I will, yes, uh -huh. going to. I got to drink a lot of coffee before and stay up till. I uh, see. No, I'm not making <laughs> long length jokes. I say it's bad as long. Right. Enjoy it if you want to watch it. Mm -hmm. Well, we appreciate uh, your time today. And